Hi guys, I am indeed grateful for your support on my previous video tutorials and I'm glad to share to you another DIY that I did for my mom's birthday. So for this video, I'm going to share how I decorated the party using balloon garlands as centerpiece, Oreo cake pops as our party giveaways, and a DIY cake decor that will surely save you some money. To create our project, we will need some balloons, a balloon pump, a craft wire, and also a cutter. As you can see, I also have some artificial leaves here that will add a touch of nature to our balloon garlands. We start our project by inflating the balloons. Since this is only a centerpiece, we don't have to pump it as much. Please keep in mind that when making balloon columns, we pump the balloons in different sizes. For this project of mine, I prefer 2 to 7 pumps per balloon. It's up to you how big or small you prefer your balloon garlands is, but this is the ideal for my centerpiece. Now that we have inflated all the balloons, we're gonna pair them up and tie them together. Pair balloons with different sizes and different colors to give an effect on our centerpiece. Now that we have paired all our balloons, we're gonna attach each balloon pair to our craft wire through this hole in the middle where the twist meets. Please be extra careful when doing this tap and don't let the end of your craft wire touch the body of the balloon if you don't want to end up with burst ones. So keep on attaching balloon pair one after another until you reach your desired length. So this is my colon and I'm just attaching an extra single balloon at the end of it. So this sub is just optional, it's up to you if you want to place more or not, but for me, I think I wanted to place an extra one on each side. Here I'm just trying to figure out how I would like my balloon colon to look like, so I'm moving it and then probably interchanging some balloons to get my ideal picture. Now, last part is adding a touch of nature to our balloon garlands through these artificial leaves. You can also use some ivies or flowers or whatever you want or desire to enhance the look of your balloon garland. So that is our first project which is the balloon garland centerpiece and I actually made a pair because we've used two long tables for my mom's birthday. Now let's go to our second project, which is Oreo Pops. For our giveaways, of course, we would need some Vickies, cake pop straws, a pack of candy melts, and also some sprinkles to decorate our cake pops. First, prepare your Oreo Vickies on a plate and carefully break them in half. Because we're dealing with food here, please make sure that you have washed your hand prior to touching any of these bikis.
Next, pour the candy melt on a microwave safe plate or bowl. Then melt the candy on a microwave according to the instruction in the pack. So you better check the pack before doing this step. Here I am merely checking the consistency of my candy melt. So if it's still too thick, please don't hesitate to put it back in a microwave for an extra minute until you get your preferred consistency of the candy melt. Now, dip the end of the straw into our melted candy, then place it in the indented cream of our Oreo bikis. This will stand as an adhesive of our Oreo Pops. Repeat this step to the rest of the Oreos. Oh guys, if you're wondering, I've also melted a chocolate candy because the white chocolate that I had a while ago didn't have the right consistency that I wanted. So this is the consistency that the candy melt must have. Then, dip the attached Oreo pop into our candy melt and make sure that all the sides are covered with melted candy. Apparently, patience is really needed in this step because you have to wait for all the excess chocolate to drip. You would know that you're all ready to sprinkle the cake pop if the chocolate doesn't drip anymore. Now that it's no longer dripping, you can start placing all the sprinkles. So you may use whatever colors or decorations you prefer. So I got a flamingo candy in here, a pineapple one, and some flowers to complete the decor. Also, don't forget to place a wax paper or baking paper on the plate where you will transfer the covered cake pops. The baking paper or wax paper will stop the chocolate from sticking directly to the plate. And it will also be easier for us to take it off once they're all frozen. And as usual, just keep on repeating this step until you covered all the cake pops. Then, please set them aside to cool down. And as easy as that, we now have some chocolate covered Oreo Pops as our party giveaways. So these are just some of the finished products. I still have a lot of them in the fridge. This next step is optional. So since this is a party giveaway, I decided to cover it with plastic and tie it with a ribbon. But it's still okay if you just wanted to display it on a mere plate. That is totally fine. So it's just up to your own preferences. I really wanted to cover it with plastic because I'm gonna place it on the table for each guest. So that is my second project for my mom's birthday. And lastly, our third project is DIY cake topper. Among our three projects, this is the easiest one. So we only need a cake and some artificial leaves and flowers to go with the theme. There is no specific instruction when it comes to decorating your own cake. So just play with your imagination, make use of all the resources, place whatever you want to place on the cake, and just be creative. So instead of paying more than $100 for a cake like this, why not just make your own? I mean, just buy a plain cake and then decorate it. 
The advantage of this DIY is that you can customize the cake according to what you plan in your head. I mean, you can really give a design to your baker, but then that means extra cost or extra expense. So there you go, we're done with our third project, our cake. Hopefully you've learned something from this DIY and thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, hit like and press the notification bell for updates of my new videos. Hi guys, say hi guys. Say hi guys. Hi guys. Can you say? Aliyah. Aliyah, oi. <laughs>